Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Okay, guys. So we are done with our insert part, our read part, and our update part. Uh, in our CRUD series, just started uh, four or three videos earlier in our Java Swing series. So now in this uh, tutorial, we are going to learn about the delete part, uh, the last one of our CRUD series, and uh, for that purpose, I will take a button that is. I will name it as delete okay now let me show you that how we will be deleting our records okay I will uh, I have added this delete button uh, and I will click a record and will click this button and it will delete the record so you can see uh, for that purpose uh, we will uh, first get our selected row and then the column in which IDs are shown so let me show you that how we will be doing it so double click this button and right here so first we are going to uh, take the selection of our row so click uh, right end row equal to okay name of our table is this is table and it is named as table okay write table dot get selected row and let me show you system dot out dot print ln row okay just run it and you will be seeing it in here okay i click i select first row and click this button so you can see zero so rows starts from zero that is first row is zero second is one third is two and so on just like array uh, as the index of array starts from zero in the same way these rows starts from zero as well okay we have selected our row and now we have to target uh, now we have to target the cell in which ids are um, given so that is the first uh, cell and for that i will write string cell equal to table we have to select the table and table is the name of our table and uh, now get model it it gets us all the data in the table and now get value at so the first one will be row we have to mention row in here and the second parameter is to mention the column so columns also starts from zero okay now this is error incompatible types object okay to string now it is fine so we have uh, selected our cell uh, in which id is there and now take the query part a string SQL is equal to write your query delete okay delete from table name is users from users where ID let me show you this is our table name and this field is uh, containing the ID that is the primary key and, and unique uh, value is in there so its name is ID so let me show you where ID is equal to sorry ID is equal to uh, this one cell okay now write the try catch block PST is equal to con dot prepare statement okay and now run PST dot execute okay now if it is executed successfully we would like to have a message in dialog box J option pen J option page not <laughs> J option pen dot show message dialog box null and 
tell me that okay sorry what is happening today to uh, deleted successfully I think I'm nervous <laughs> J option pan dot show message dialog okay if it is deleted successfully then this message will be prompted and if it is not deleted successfully and if there is a problem any problem then it will uh, prompt us that exceptional error okay now run shift f6 and you can see just click on one of the records i click add number uh, record number eight and click delete and you can see record deleted successfully but it's still in there so let me close it and run it again and you can see it okay so we would like to uh, update the table at the same time as well so for that purpose I have I am having a method which is updating the table let me show you that is update table this method updates the table so come to our delete method delete event and uh, okay what's happening no 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 <laughs> please come on okay after this you have to have this method written okay run the file now record number seven delete and you can see it is disappeared and the table is updated at the same time now we have to close this connection as well so that I have discussed this earlier in the series um, with the file name as database is logged you can see that video why we write this step you can see that video uh, in this series okay finally and write another try catch block okay and uh, write here pst dot close and rs dot close okay run it and uh, record number two delete and you can see so that was about this tutorial and uh, hope you guys have learned the delete part uh, and uh, if you have any question you can uh, ask me in the comment box if you like my video please like my video like hit like button and subscribe my channel for other videos in this series and also we will be learning something something uh, in java and other languages as well so thank you for watching thank you for now